This is one of the hardest SAT math questions ever given on an exam. Can you solve it? So it says, in the figure arc, SBT is one quarter of a circle with center R and a radius 6. If the length plus the width of the rectangle ABCR is 8, then the perimeter of the shaded region is... Okay, so in this picture, we're looking for the perimeter of the shaded region. Now, immediately what stands out to me is that SRT is a quarter circle, and then we have some uh, shapes inscribed in it. So ABCR is a rectangle, ACR is a right triangle, and ABC is a right triangle. Um, so first we need to actually write out an equation for what the perimeter is going to be. So we just have to add up all the sides together. So that's going to be SA, this little thing, plus AC, the diagonal, plus CT, and then plus the arc um, ST. So now we just have to solve what each of these little things is, and then we can get the perimeter. So for SA, let's rewrite it into SR minus AR. The, this this helps us get closer to known lengths as we know that SR is 6 and we can deduce what AR is later. So let's make it SR minus AR. Then AC, we can just keep that like that. Um, CT, we can also do the same thing we did with SA and turn that into TR minus CR plus TR minus CR. And then ST we can already solve for as we know that is going to be the arc length for a quarter of a circle, which is 2 pi r divided by 4. Um, so that's going to be 2 pi times 6 divided by 4, which just becomes 3 pi. So we'll write that in. Now, SR minus AR, so we know AR is going to be, um, so sorry, we know that SR is going to be 6, so we can write 6 in for that. And we also know that TR is 6 because that's the radius. Um, we also actually know that AC is also going to be 6. This is because AC is a diagonal of the rectangle and BR is also another diagonal. And what we know about diagonals and rectangles is that they are actually congruent, meaning that they have the same side length. So this B, uh, AC is also going to be 6 and BR is a radius as it extends from the center uh, R to an outside edge B. So we get 6 minus AR plus 6 plus 6 minus CR, and then we get plus 3 pi. Now, if we rearrange this to get AR and CR next to each other, uh, we actually see that AR is this length and CR is this width. And that means, uh, the question actually gives us that the length plus the width is 8, so that means that we're going to be subtracting 8 for this entire uh, equation. So we have 18 plus 3 pi minus 8 equals 10 plus 3 pi. And this is our final answer, which is answer choice B. Let me know in the comments if you guys were able to get B before me.